Hello all and welcome back. Today we are going to design this beautiful infographic using PowerPoint. Let's get started. Let's first enable the guides and format the background with two-step radial gradient. Set its direction through center and change stop colors to white and light gray color. Next go to Smart Art option under Insert tab and select Basic Cycle Design Pattern. Add additional shapes and make it total of 8 circles. Now ungroup this pattern 2 times and then delete all arrow shapes. Also delete two circle shapes which are along the horizontal guide. Next select all circle shapes and format them with two step linear gradient with same stop colors. Change the direction and adjust the gradient stop position until you get desired effect. Next format all circles outline with two step linear gradient and adjust their stop position. Change left gradient stop color to white and set right gradient stop to 100% transparency. Also increase the outline width to 3 points. Next we will create shadow effect at the back end of each circle shapes. Instead of using inbuilt shadow effect option, it's always better to create artificial shadow effect using circle shape and soft edges feature. Align this shadow shape over the circle shape and send it to back. Now drag this shadow shape holding down control key and place it at the back end of all circle shapes. That looks perfect. Next go to insert tab and draw circle shape through center holding down control and shift keys. Apply same circle format using format painter option and add a shadow shape at the back end. Make sure to increase the size of shadow shape as per circle size requirement. Now go to insert tab, draw right arrow shape and adjust its size. Again apply same circle format to this arrow shape using format painter option. Duplicate it using ctrl plus D, flip it horizontally and place it symmetric to original shape. Next apply outer shadow effect and adjust its distance and blur values. Next using ellipse shape, we will create cut section effect at the end of both arrow shapes. Format it with two-step path gradient and change left gradient stop color to dark gray. Set right gradient stop to 100% transparency and remove its outline.
Now copy and paste it as image and delete original ellipse shape. We basically do this way to not to disturb gradient pattern when we subtract any shapes. Cut this ellipse shape into half by subtracting a rectangle shape as shown. Adjust its size and place it at the end of both arrow shapes. Now go to insert tab and draw circle shape through center holding down control and shift keys. Make sure the circle passes through center of all small circle shapes. Make it no fill, change its outline color and send it to back. Finally add all text fields and PNG icons onto our design. Let's speed up to save time. So here is the final preview. Hope you all liked it. Please don't forget to like, share and comment. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.